Thank you. Yeah. So, thank you. What made you come up with the name Six? Y'all gonna think I'm crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all gonna think I'm crazy. Nothing's off the table. <laughs> oh, Lord Jesus. Welcome to a new episode of Those Very Own Deal, Deal With It Podcast. Podcast. <laughs> I'm your host, Erin, Boss May G. And I'm Haley Ree. And today we would like to introduce you to our special guest. Her name is Bree. Hey, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, you guys? <laughs> Hey, Bree. Hey, hey, I'm so glad I'm here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You we nervous? glad to yeah, have you. Don't um, be. Definitely nervous. Yeah, don't be nervous. This is a safe space. Is this Thank your you first interview? Yeah. Hey, I ain't nobody. Girl! <laughs> you are somebody. I am. Y'all are too. I, y'all doing it big up in here. It look real expensive in here. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> no, we yeah. excited to have you, though, for real. I'm glad yeah. you said yeah to come. Of course. Yeah. Yes. Aesthetic, of course. With the lovely treats. Yeah, see, Brie on the treats. What? what is it that you brought? Um, so these are cheesecake cupcakes on top. It's like a strawberry crunch with some golden Oreos on top. Okay, mm-hmm. I can't wait to get into mm-hmm. that. Yeah, I can't wait mm-hmm. to get into that. <laughs> um, starting off, like, ugh, I hate saying like all the time, but I say that a lot in the interviews. I do too. Yeah, I do too. Yes, <laughs> but um, where are you from? Um, I was born in Port Arthur. What? Really? Yeah, a lot of people don't know that. <laughs> but I was raised in Killeen, which is like about five hours away. Oh, yeah. oh, I thought you girl. was from Beaumont or Orange. I, yeah, I, I went to Orange. I went to school in Beaumont, like two years, graduated in Orange. But I was born in Port Arthur. Okay. <laughs> Y'all look crazy. shocked to say like, no, I for real. I am I, shocked. I, I see you in yeah. I see you in the hospital. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> That's crazy. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm shocked. <laughs> I'm really so shocked. So we did our research. Yeah. We ain't doing good. We ain't good. doing good. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's okay. No, because we're like, okay, she's from Orange. Yeah, we've like, been trying to I just to graduated from there. I was there for like a year and a half. Not even a full year. Not long. Okay. Yeah. okay. Did you like it out there? It was cool. Girl, it's country. Y'all have country nothing out there. Yeah. Oh, shit. Ain't shit out there. This country. So <laughs> that, that did change what? Because we had questions about, you know. Um... I mean, we was at the most gonna ask you like how it felt staying there yeah. when there's nothing there. Oh, in orange? Yeah. It's boring, ain't nothing to do but drink. Well <laughs> <laughs> kick it with your friends. I mean I was going to school then, so it was just like Yeah. Yeah. So how was it. how was West Orange? Um Yeah, don't talk about me. <laughs> Orange was ghetto. <laughs> ghetto? So Orange I've is heard. definitely so I've heard. Yeah. Orange is definitely ghetto. But what? it's fun though. It's good country fun. Uh-huh. Good old country fun for sure. Wait, like so hold on. Wait, I like people get, from Orange get, though. Get, they be cool. Yeah, they get get cool. cool. They be cool for sure. Like, Do you have friends from Orange that like you still friends yeah, with? Yeah, of course. Of yeah. course. Out there, everybody's related to each other because it's so small. Mm-hmm. So me coming from, you know, Beaumont, Colleen, they like, who is this girl? We you ain't one of us <laughs> who your people <laughs> on me on me so a lot of them knew me from social media though so it was a little bit easier to get comfortable with everybody but they're very welcoming it's just country that's all what they knew you <laughs> as little uzi fan you girl you already know <laughs> <laughs> you already know that's crazy definitely yeah definitely. that's so cool sure. So you do like Lil Uzi, though. I love Lil Uzi. Yeah? Look, let's talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> what you like about him? Literally everything. Um, I feel like he just has such an influence on me because he's not afraid to be himself. And he's very comfortable in the skin he's in. And I feel like from 2016 when he first dropped, I was, what, a sophomore? Mm-hmm. No, no, I was a junior. Junior, sophomore, junior. Um, It just... I grew into it. Like, you know what I'm saying? We grew together type shit. Yeah. And I was just like, this is this is exactly how I want to express myself. I feel like, if anything, this is me. This is mm-hmm. your favorite <laughs> Yeah. This is my person. This is how a you, person. How you feel about his love? His love? Um, JT. <laughs> she rolled her eyes, y'all. Jatavia. Y'all can't see. Jatavia. <laughs> Leave my man alone. <laughs> Leave my man alone. <laughs> that's Leave it. Alone. That's it. That's all. But you, you like her, though. Yeah, she cool. Yeah. She cool. That's a bad bitch. For sure, sure. I love the way she carries herself. She don't 
she not scared to just tell you what it is. That's a funny bitch right there too. Yeah, yeah. she take her for a man too. For sure, show. that's my man. Definitely got side him. Yeah, I can side with that because yeah. you know what? That might be our man. <laughs> but you know what I'm saying? I don't mind sharing it with him. <laughs> <laughs> not for right now. You, okay. <laughs> Have you ever got to see him? Like you? I mean, not like I mean, well, period concert or yeah, 2016 when he was. Almost a nobody, pretty much. Um, he was at South by Southwest, and I saw him for the first time. Okay, how yeah. was that? It was life changing. <laughs> That's why I act like this now. Like, <laughs> like I was oh like, who God. is this little dude? Like, yeah. you know, what I'm saying? He, he's, he's short. He's short. He's short. Girl, he, he like look five four, five two, five four. He was short. He looks yeah. short, but and I I'm four just... sevens. He make me look puny. Like, yeah. Four seven for real. Right. I feel like I'm taller than you. Definitely, I'm five one. Yeah, you're definitely taller than me. What? <laughs> you met somebody that's shorter than me? What? Yeah. It's not Nari. Oh, that's Nari. crazy. I didn't know that. Didn't Nari's know that shorter than me, yeah. Oh. Mm-hmm. What? That's crazy. So, how did you come about him? Um, I really don't even know. I believe it was one of his old, old, old songs, Count and Rose. Some 2015, 2016 type era. Mm-hmm. That's really what it was. And I was just like, this is different. I like different. Mm-hmm. And then growing up, I was on like Tyler and Off, Fe- you yeah. know, Off mm-hmm. Future and them. So that was just like from Lil B to Tyler Creator onto Uzi. Like it was just, it was inevitable. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. That's good. Sure. That's good. Because sure. 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 that's where I know you from. I know you from Twitter. Yeah, everybody say the same thing. <laughs> yeah, I probably either Instagram or Twitter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Then we both we are same situation. <laughs> I was like, oh, hey, let me do my hair. <laughs> you gotta do yes. For sure. And it was and so then I cute. I bought that super cute outfit for me at one time. I was hey, like, yeah, Aaron, I'm right. Shout sure. out to me, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to rebrand, man. Yeah, I'm excited. Wait. I'm excited. Thank you. I thank you. I can't wait. I can't wait. I miss y'all. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I love seeing my girls looking good. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you still, um, you still be going out? Like, do you go out often? Or I just recently decided to go out and be seen. Um, I was in the house for a minute. It's just, especially going on Beaumont, y'all. Ain't much. Ain't nothing really to see. It's the same. It's the same, same people, people same thing. But I'm outside this summer for sure. Show. Really? <laughs> so, so I, what made you be put up? <laughs> um. A lot, really. Since I had the baby, I gained a lot of weight and stuff like that. I've been Girl, in the gym, you look though. Cool. Look, okay, I've been in the gym, though, y'all. That's the only reason why. Everybody okay. was tuned in to your page yesterday because you look so thick. Good. <laughs> Hold on, wait. Hold on, I gotta see. And she said on Twitter that was looking because she looks so thick. Girl, a monkey. Who you was? Girl, nowhere but Jerusalem. You know, nowhere but Jerusalem. But, um, yeah, everybody ain't seen me in damn near years. So, you popped out. That's free. Mm-hmm. Yeah. She's been eating good. Just green. <laughs> <laughs> that bad bad. Hey. Hey. I'm dead. Y'all. But no, you do look good, though. Thank y'all. Yeah, y'all look really amazing. Good. Y'all look really cute. glowing. These lights got y'all. Thank you. Yeah, that's the goal. That's the goal. <laughs> that's good, man. So, has it been like, has it been a challenge for you finding yourself again after having your baby? Absolutely. Absolutely. Just the transition of like, it wasn't big, but just before my son, I was not nurturing at all. But when you have that baby, it comes naturally. Like it makes you, you know what I'm saying? Soft. This is my this is my mm-hmm. person. Like I'm over this. Too. I have to <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm really out here responsible for somebody's life, you know? Yeah. So it's just like it made me mature a lot faster too, which was a great thing. I definitely needed it. Mm-hmm. Um as far as like who I am now, um, I'm so always gonna be weird. <laughs> I love that I can always express myself, but um, I don't know. I definitely calmed down a lot more. I, I was like it. Very book wild. It was embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> looking but, back, but yeah, yeah. I look back and show. see looking back. I was like, like girl, who's this person? Like. It's yeah. not even me no more. Yeah, yeah that's crazy. Yeah. Me too. I'll yeah. be tired before the club close. Girl, <laughs> I'm to be in the bed at 10 o'clock. Like, no, I don't be it. 10 o'clock, 10 30, I'm ready to go to sleep. Mm-hmm. That's that mom life. Yeah, it's cool. I'm good mother. <laughs> 
Yeah. Still pop out when I wanted to. Though. I hear Still pop out. For sure. For How sure. old is your son now? He's two. He's two. He made two in February. So uh, did he? Your um your pastry business is called Sixes Sweets Two. Yeah, Sixes Sweet Two. Okay, so did he inspire you to start your pastry business, or were you already doing this and just? Had a different name or no 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 he definitely inspired me because look y'all the origin is I was pregnant big and pregnant and I was craving cheesecake nobody wanted to give me cheesecake at two o'clock in the morning so I'm like you know what I'm gonna make it myself like okay. and it just went off from there I watched a bunch of TikToks <laughs> TikTok definitely helped me out um mm. and I just started trying stuff yeah okay. yeah and it just kind of stuck you know I didn't think people would really fuck with it for real but like it turned into something way different and it just i wouldn't mind doing this for forever I'm yeah so, so do you see yourself having um a bakery absolutely or? absolutely yeah. i was hoping y'all asked me that too because yeah. y'all need to be on the lookout for that <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay. okay. So so you did. So what you, yeah what you said like you said pretty soon like real soon or is it like a making mm, like, like a five year span y'all doing okay okay, okay that's a good saying. that's a good um, it's definitely an investment though. that i would love to make yeah. though because but sure, that's good sure. you found something you love to my do. own yeah. niche for sure that yeah. made me feel like i have purpose i love to bake that's like, good that's yeah. cool because a lot of people don't find something they really good at and right. they be you know older in age and it's just right. like i'm still lost what do i like to do what am i good at what exactly. can i do so mm -hmm. exactly. finding something at a young age that you good with and you know that it's you really like it's that's a blessing, a blessing for, for sure. sure that is a blessing. and i can't wait to try like i haven't got my hands on Ooh, nothing yet but i can't yet, wait to, but I can't wait to like, try my heart kind of broke because <laughs> i didn't get a cup but it's okay because when you post them again i'm going to get oh, one. Oh, for sure yeah. you're the first person i'm gonna bring it to i just sold out today that's all that's all the situation that's good and make your money. Make your money. <laughs> so this is an everyday thing that you do. I try you to make it every day. Okay. Yeah, I try to make it every day. But if anything, it's every other day, you know. Mm -hmm. Or I'll keep it like a weekend type, make your orders before I do start doing some other stuff type thing, you know. What's your favorite thing to bake? Probably this. Cupcakes, cheesecake yeah. cupcakes. This is the most popular, but everything else is pretty much seasonal. I do my sweet potato cheesecakes, those Thanksgiving, Christmas. That's when it's really hot. Yeah. Um, but these are definitely my favorite, though. See, as she had got a uh, cheesecake, the oh, yeah. sweet potato one. And she showed me a picture. Y'all tore it up. No, but I didn't get You didn't try it? No. Oh, my God. I didn't get to. That's so, this going to be my first time trying some. Okay, okay, okay. I'm cool. excited, though. She said it was good. Yeah, I'm glad. So, <laughs> I'm ready. You put your foot in it? Grab my elbow, all the ankle, all the knee. <laughs> and then at the bottom, at the at the very bottom is my heart, y'all. Oh, I like to eat your heart. Hold <laughs> on, <laughs> feeling special. I know, right? You making us feel special. Of course, of course. Uh, <laughs> I'm excited to have to try it. <laughs> I'm loving Ooh. the energy already. Yes. I feel like your I'm heart smiling. is right here. Yeah, I'm smiling. I'm smiling. I'm smiling hard. I'm smiling yeah. hard. But that's really cool, though. That's cool. So you found a passion in For baking. Sure. What? So, like, how how long do it take you to prep all of this? Like, when you doing cheesecakes, you doing the big mm. sweet potato um cheesecakes, like... How long do it take you to do all day? Like, is this an all day process? Definitely what? a full day type of deal. I gotta, yeah. I gotta make sure I'm not doing nothing. I gotta make sure six is put up, taken care of. That way, I can just focus in the kitchen. And it takes yeah. pretty much all day, yeah. So he don't be in your way. <laughs> like he'll up. he'll tap me, you know. Little, mm, can I have some? Yeah, I'll make him a little bowl with some strawberries on on top. You know, a little mm -hmm. snack. But like this, it takes so much of my attention. That, you know, I just try to keep him out the kitchen. Yeah. But um, as far as, like, the whole process, making it, freezing it. Freezing it take about mm, eight hours. So mm. when people place orders, they're not getting it till about 48 hours later. Yeah. Which, I mean, unless I'm pre-making it and mm -hmm. then they'll get the same day. Like, you know, it's not too crazy, but... Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, I wake up, I be like, oh, I got everybody's name on the list. Okay, they pay, they pay, they pay. She want four, he want six, they want 12. I just knock it out. Okay, yeah. I didn't know cheesecake. Like, I thought it was something you whip up. 
and then you put it on there and you serve. Well, I just, I just serve. I like to serve it cold. That's yeah. all. Especially okay. the cupcakes. Those are probably defrosted now because they've been in the freezer all day. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so they're just about ready whenever y'all are. Okay. <laughs> so I know you say you like to be weird, you like to be different. Like, what's your birthday? October the 11th. What's your sign? I'm a Libra. Okay. <laughs> you what feel you like you were like I'm you're a Virgo. Virgo. And you're say it all the time. A Leo, a Leo yeah. I, I, knew that, I, knew that. I knew that from the episode I watched. <laughs> <laughs> y'all, she was tuned in to episode one. Where okay. y'all we might give out some free prizes for the people that really be watching. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so make sure if y'all didn't tune in, stop right now. Go watch the last one and then come back. <laughs> Period. Period. <laughs> yeah, y'all. You feel oh. like you relate to your sign of light? Um, yes and no. As far as like, a lot of people be saying Libras be lying. <laughs> <laughs> I don't be lying about big stuff. I lie about the little stuff. You know, a little white lie, a little fib or two. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But I know, I know some September Libras that really be letting it go. And it's just like, no, you know damn well. You going hard. Yeah. <laughs> Too much. That's that Virgo in them a little bit, you know? Because you know it's just Look like, her side eye. Uh- <laughs> <laughs> she just threw you under the bus like, <laughs> well, that that's that Virgo. That, she that like, do no, say no. that, though, huh? <laughs> uh, what, 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 tell us. Tell us, Virgo. Yeah, let you tell us. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> y'all, we don't be lying. Mm-hmm. We just don't tell the full truth. <laughs> <laughs> we just gonna tell y'all the part we want to tell y'all. Yeah. Now, I may say a little, like you say, a little white lie, but little if fib. it's serious, I'm gonna tell you, like, okay, I lied. Yeah. But, <laughs> but if sure. it's just for I'm jokes, I'm, yeah. <laughs> yeah. if it's for jokes, like, I'm gonna lie, I'm gonna see how far we gonna go, and then later I'll be like, you believed me. Right. <laughs> I was because Haley, that's her. Yeah, that's yeah. definitely That's you. <laughs> Haley, Haley, I will believe it. And I'm going to keep going. And, yeah. Do y'all know y'all's big three? Like, y'all, y'all uh, sun and moon and rising? I looked it up before yeah. on one website. But then mm-hmm. I looked it on another site, and it was two different things. So I was like, That's I don't crazy. know. Maybe I had to pay for the um, pay for it to <laughs> Girl, get you the, know how the, the little sites be. Yeah, yeah mm-hmm. I just went on Google, like, what's my sun, my moon? And the other thing, yeah, and rising. it was just a little science, and so I clicked it, but I, mean, I probably did have to pay for it because yeah. I just skipped past the subscription. <laughs> uh, I didn't, I didn't get off into all it. I just know I'm a fire sign. That's all I know. I think I'm an but, earth sign. Though. Yes, yeah, earth sign. Okay, you know, you know. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. They say Leo's be lying too. I feel like when I was everybody lie y'all. Yeah. Y'all all be lying, so don't act like y'all don't. Yeah. <laughs> yeah if y'all act like y'all don't, y'all lying. Yeah, y'all lie. I feel like when I was younger, I used to lie. <laughs> for sure, for sure. I used to lie, man, about stupid stuff. Yeah, that's everybody. I don't stupid think stuff. I started lying till I got older. When I got older, I was just like. Nah, that's bad. I'm just, I'm just going to lie. I just feel like lying today. Fuck well, it, I'm going real quick. Nah, when I was a kid, lie. I felt like I ain't had nothing to lie about. I didn't do nothing. So yeah, that's, that's like, good. That's nothing good. to lie about. That was bad as fuck. No, literally like bad. stupid shit. I was shit. a very bad I was kid. I was <laughs> like, doing dumb stuff. Everybody tell me I was a really good kid. The last product-based business course you'll ever need. No more YouTube surfing, TikTok University, and running about hundreds of seminars to gather info. Learn how to drive traffic, price your products properly, find the right manufacturers and third-party logistics, scale your business with other people's money, OPM, as well as how to streamline your business with AI, all in one centralized location, profit with products, course from the creator of Mystique Naturals, home of the chemical-free temporary hair colors. We'll link that in the um, video at the bottom. Down below. Y'all check it out if y'all really ready to take y'all business to the next level. So you like your drink? I do. It's really good. Mm, it's a little Hennessy, <laughs> Red Bull, Splash, Mimosa. Mm-hmm. I seen you like green tea shots. I do. That throw juice. <laughs> <laughs> that throw juice that you sipping on. I like green tea shots too, but lately I ain't been fooling with them. You got to like, get Jameson Orange next time. Get the Jameson. Tell Try them I want. What, what they usually use, lime? Uh, no, I don't think it's lime now. 
I think it's just regular Jameson. Regular Jameson? Okay, yeah. I'm going to have to ask him about the orange kind. Because yeah. I don't know, lately, since I've been settling on my stomach, right? I actually switched to getting star fuckers. You What's that? Know? She put me on. What is that? Girl. Try it. Try What's it. in it? Ooh, uh, Red wait. Bull. I think some type of dark. Mm. Um, sweet and sour. It's sweet. It's good. It's good. Okay, it gets you there. I like shit this too. You know. It sweet. I think they put sweet and sour in some green tea shots too. Okay, cool. So it's cool. you. It's not like a sour drink though, but it's good. Like it's smooth. It's kind of like this, like a smooth drink. Yeah. And it be cold, and it get you. Drunk. What's the the G two shot? G two shots. I think that Gatorade. Gatorade. And it's like purple, huh? I've had it. It's the oh, purple. No. Uh, when we had it, I think it was green. No. No, I thought it was like red. Red. Mm. Probably depend on the color that you use. Yeah, the yeah. color game, right? <laughs> we need a um, we need a uh, what's it called? A bartender on the show next to break some down to us. Yeah. Hmm. I'll be our mixologist. Okay. Oh, you got <laughs> a <little> slash bartender. <laughs> yeah, you got a little something something with it too. No. Oh, okay. I'm just talking. About it. But I do it. I do it. Y'all. <laughs> Come back in. Shake the. Oh me. Right. Yeah. Oh, right. <laughs> bartender, I'm like I'm away. <laughs> Bartender, please. <laughs> okay. Mm, that's what I'm thinking about. That's what I'm thinking about, Hadley. <laughs> yeah, pretty. That's something for us to think about. Um, we really clown all day on here. Like, when we tell people, just come and be chill, we really sure. mean, like, just come and be chill. Like, everybody be like, they nervous. You could tell, like, from your guests that they feed off of y'all's energy. So, the fact that y'all's chemistry is as good as it, good as it is, like, it, it reflects on the show so we y'all are doing great keep y'all talking keep y'all, y'all comfortable yeah, like, sure. y'all let's great. have fun we were just talking about bleeding off and look at look, look what we're talking about bleeding off on each other <laughs> your energy is contagious yeah. y'all just keep everybody smiling and y'all do it good that's yeah. cool <laughs> and that's how we felt like we talked um, we talked about before do you feel like the people you surround yourself with now mm-hmm. are positive people or do you feel like absolutely absolutely definitely had to change my circle and who I spent my energy with, um, especially having a child. Like, I don't want to go out, kick it with people that are so negative, come home, and I'm um, reflecting, yeah, 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 reflecting what I just did onto my child. So, um, I definitely had to switch my friends. Up. Yeah. I Shout out to people, my new friends. <laughs> <laughs> I tell people all the time, though, motherhood is really changing. Like, definitely. And no matter what age, like, definitely. you're never just ready for it, but when you get there, it's like, Okay, yeah. it's changing. There's no handbook, nothing. Nothing. Yes. Just do it. out there. I'm good. What works for you. <laughs> mm-hmm. For sure, for sure. Whatever works for each parent, you know, is different. You have, like, a, a strong support system? Absolutely. Yeah. It, it was a, it's a lot stronger than what I thought it would be. Like, when I was first pregnant, I was like, oh, my God, my mom going to disown me. Like, I'm pregnant. <laughs> you know, the typical yeah. scare. Yeah. But, like... It's been two years now. My mom loves being a grandma. She yeah. loves being in Six's life. She, got, she has a uh, baby too. Like yeah, I got brother. a five. I got a five year old brother, y'all. <laughs> Me and my mom was doing it at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> so how was that? Crazy. It was crazy. How's that relationship? Yeah. Six, boys. Looks, six looks at his uncle like, "What's up, bro? Like, we kicking it today? Like, what's like? Yeah. <laughs> they friends. They really growing up crazy. together. That's cool. Sure. It's it is cool. It is cool. It's so do your brother treat you like? Uh, like a sister, or do he treat you more like oh, yeah. an adult? Like, no. oh, I'm gonna respect her. Like, both she's my brothers, adult. they think we friends. <laughs> they think we're friends for sure. I got a fifteen. Yeah, gotta tell six like, now. look, you're not my brother. Yeah. I'm your mama. So exactly, with me. exactly. Six, six definitely thinks that is sweet, but. I don't care right now. As he gets older, you know, yeah. I'm mm-hmm. toughen up. Yeah. His name is so cute. Thank that you. Is so Thank cute. you. What made you come up with the name Six? Y'all gonna think I'm crazy. <laughs> yeah, go take a crazy. Nothing's off the table. Oh, Lord Jesus. So, Lil Uzi. Lil Uzi, shout like out to Uzi. Now. Shout out to Uzi. Lil Uzi rep 1600 block. Mm-hmm. 16 is my favorite number now. So, okay. I made my son six. That's all it is. Just a little delusional. Just <laughs> not right in the head. That's it. Paul. That's all it is. <laughs> It's crazy. It is definitely insane. how somebody really like can inspire you. There's you influence just, like yeah. that, and but that's one thing cool. our show is about too. Like you never know who go watch this and yeah. who may w- want to be a baker and be like, 
Oh, look that girl. She a baker. That's she didn't even know she was going to be baking. And now they just listening to you like, I could do that too now. Yeah, that's, mm-hmm. that's, I'm glad y'all have this platform so people can watch and actually be inspired by what we are doing. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I want this to be something that everybody watches and takes something from. Um, you have peers that, that are here to help you as well. Um, and don't be afraid to do what you want to do. For right. sure. Right. Just go for it. Right. Just go, just go for it. Just go for it. Not just do it. Just go for it. Stamp it. Because a lot of times procrastination will just slow people Absolutely. down. Yeah. Or the, the thought Absolutely. of how are people going to feel when they see it. Like what people going to think. Who going to be talking about me. Who going to say negative stuff. But exactly. yeah. like you say, just go for it. Yeah, for sure. That's how it was about today. I'm like, oh, Lord. Don't nobody know me for real. They about to ask me all types of crazy questions. But like... Y'all my homegirls now. We home what girls what now. type of crazy questions you I think you can No, I'm thinking it's like, Carisha, please. Like, mm-hmm. <laughs> I mean, no, it's it's not more so. We can get into it. We can get into some stuff. <laughs> we can get into it. Our platform isn't <laughs> yeah. built on mess, though. Yes, it's, 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 not, not, it's, not, yeah, it's not just that. People <laughs> are people behind what they do. Yeah, sure. Like, yeah, like sure. you say, a lot of people know you from Twitter. Yeah. So they probably just know you from Brie, XOB Word, exactly. Lil Uzi Lover. She cool, she weird, she, she cool. crazy, she look fun. Yeah. But they don't know, like, you really kind of chill. Like, yeah. you just chill. Yeah, like, I'm yeah, a mom, I'm, I'm cool. See, my, my sister is... Weird. It it took a lot for her to change her Instagram name, XO Weirdo. Sure. But yeah, we say weird, not a bad weird. Yeah, that's like, not, that's, that's not cool. Like, Ash is cool, though. She's <laughs> exactly. Ash is a vibe. And when yeah. they get to know Ash, because yeah. when you first oh, see it, it's like, she's just a pretty girl. They may think like, oh, she's what she not. And when you meet Ash, it's like, yeah, she sure. a vibe. You <laughs> know, like, it's just, it's crazy. You just you. Like, you just yeah. you, yeah. and they you. could just be them, be yeah. them, and do what you want. Yeah. Like you never like know who will support you. Exactly, people will rock with you a lot more if you just be yourself. So be yourself. I've been comfortable in the skin I'm in for a minute now, and a lot of people <laughs> struggle with that. A lot of people struggle with that. They yeah. get intimidated, you know, try to feel like they need to fit in, like yeah. you know, with certain vibes that people give, for like. Sure. Be yourself. Be yourself. All that shape shifting. Y'all ain't got to do that. It's right? lame. Yeah. If, if, if people really fuck with you the way they're supposed to, then they'll accept you as you are. Yeah. And I actually, y'all, it's so crazy because I actually see myself one day writing a book. Like, I want to do that. You can I do it. I wanna, you can definitely do and it. And I want to name it Standing Alone. Okay, okay. yeah. Stamp because, that. Standing Alone. <laughs> y'all hear that? Because, like, so many people just want to be like everybody. Yeah. And so many people just really can't be themselves. Exactly. And I'm a person that always just can stand out to stand by myself. Exactly. You know, like stay true to self. Stay true. As you, know? you should. As you so should. that's that's something. And, and so for some people, it's a learning thing too. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Like some people kind of gotta grow into it. I feel yeah. like growing up, I was really standoffish, not social. Really? Yeah. I was You're so social. bubbly and open. And though. I and I always you been would like that, but I just wasn't social. I yeah. was really shy. Like I'm shy, yeah. and like now that my son's starting to get a real personality. Yeah. He, I noticed that he's shy. Like, when he was oh. a baby, he used to just do anything. Like, we have him dancing and turning. Yeah. Now, <laughs> he kind of secluded. And I'm like, y'all leave him alone. Like, that's how I yeah. used to be. Oh, I was yeah. shy. Like, I'm yeah. not going to be dancing with yeah. everybody. I'm just, right. so I was secluded. But as I got older, I'm like, this not really me. I really want to be bubbly. Like, I want to yeah. talk to people. I want to just have fun. You. I want to yeah. do stuff. And so, you. I didn't really make the change to, like, seventh grade. Seventh grade, I was like... I'm going to be open. Like, I'm going to make blossom. new friends. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to be who I really want to be. And from there on, I just kept the same persona. We love it. I we love it. <laughs> I'm happy that you did. Yeah, yeah, for up. sure. But I did always. Well, you know when we was kids, it's always cool. You know, yeah, we was friends school. back in the we day. Party, yeah. We parted ways because schools, you mm-hmm. know, different schools. And yeah. Stuff. But this day went for real. Literally, so. we've been friends. That's since good. Kids, and I wish we could find us a picture. I have a picture. I have a picture. It's in my phone. Yeah. But I think it's in my other phone. Probably put it up when uh, you know. So y'all could see. Mm-hmm. You was like, in the pool. You was at my party. I don't even remember. Uh, yes. It was me, you, KJ. We was all in the pool. I'm going to have to show you. You got to show me. You got to be smiling. Remember. You got to yeah, be like, I like seeing old pictures. I'm like, telling you. I love taking pictures yeah. of stuff. And I went through a period of time, too. I didn't like take, taking pictures. I was like 
a kid's stud. Like, <laughs> Ooh, I didn't like dresses. I didn't like skirts. If my mama brought me a dress or a skirt, I would cry uh, real tears to my grandma. Like, I don't want to wear this. I don't want to get my hair done. I just want to play outside. I want to play in the dirt. Yeah. I was like a little stud. Yeah, just like, acting. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. so when I first told her, like, I want to be on the cheerleading team, she said, you going to wear a skirt? Like yes, <laughs> I'm gonna put it on. She said I'm gonna pay for everything today. Where the application is? Like Ooh, I got a daughter now. <laughs> <laughs> and from there, I'm just like, okay, yeah, I just like getting cute now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Period. You're like a Barbie doll right now. Like you do thank like you, a Barbie doll, thank sure. you. And you see, for like sure. you see this right here. I yeah. kind of got this from you. I seen you did your diamonds I'm one dead. day, and I was like, that is so cute. I never thought about I putting it right here. I was thinking about doing it, but I'm glad you did it though. At least one of us, at least one of us shining. I'm I glad was you like, did that's it. That's really cute. I hope I hope. Your thing that day, too. I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna try that it under the eye one day. Cute. And we had on other shirts early, and they had some diamonds on yeah, them. So I was yeah. like, let me just put a little something. <laughs> that's, that's the thing. You know, that goes that's to cool. show you never know what mm -hmm. you do that could rub off on somebody For else. Sure, that be yeah. like, yeah. Thank you. Cool. Yeah, that got cool. me. <laughs> I didn't even know you was inspired by it. Yeah, I thought it was good. Really because I usually put them like, I put it like right here. Yeah. Or when I got makeup done before, I just, well, we put it on the wing. Mm -hmm. yeah. I never seen it like right here. I think you had it here, yeah. here, here. I did four corners like and then I did like three. I just, mm -hmm. I need freestyle. What was it yeah. for? Girl, nothing. I just, just, just playing on my face. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it just playing. So you know how to do makeup? Not at all. I literally just learned how to do everyday face. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I want to do that. Thank you. It really takes practice. Like it takes practice because I took for sure. I took classes with Merlo. I don't know if you really. Know yeah, yeah. That's yeah, one of my friends. friends. So when he first started, he was like, "Friend, let's do a class." I'm like, "Okay." So he did one. Yeah. And he like, you got to keep practicing, but I never had nowhere to go. So I just wasn't doing my makeup. Yeah, facts. And then we did another one one day, and I still, but I remember what we talked about, and yeah. I still had the product. So now um, I start trying to go out more so I could try to do my face. Yeah. And I was like, okay, it's coming out cool. It's not somebody did it for me, but it's cool enough to go yeah, out. Yeah, yeah. Good. And now that we do this podcast, I do it every Sunday. So yeah, I'm doing it once a week. Really so good. I feel like really every yeah, week it's really like, good. okay, I'm learning something different that I like. I'm yeah. getting better. Yeah. But I'm, I'm literally just learning. Like, Me too. For girl. real? Yeah. We like, got this together. Mariah used to do my makeup. Oh. I never knew I did I nothing. Did you always used to do eyebrows? You always used to do eyebrows? No? Never. My eyebrows don't even grow, y'all. They don't grow. <laughs> <laughs> nothing. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But everyday face is good to know. Like, yeah. I always tell people it's good to know how to do you a one-two with yourself because yeah, facts. you never know who go cancel on you. You never know who That's go, sure. you know, if something come up and you can't get something done or if you're just going somewhere and you need to make an appearance. Like, right, right. I wanted to get into modeling and taking pictures and stuff for people. Yeah. And, um... The photo his photographer, he used to always call me like, hey, can you come take pictures this day, Liddell? And I would be like, oh, my God, yes, but let me find somebody to do my makeup. Never could find nobody to do my makeup. Yeah. So I passed over like three shoots with him mm -hmm. that I could have used for content. Oh I could have used for, you know, just pictures for my page, right. yeah, anything. Right. And I was just like, you got to get it together, girl. Like, <laughs> you can't just keep passing up on yeah. opportunities and yeah. stuff. You never know when somebody going to call you and be hey, like, lucky comes can you come with, with this on? Yeah, it lucky comes with being like a woman too, though. Like, yeah. I feel like I was procrastinating on just being comfortable, being girly. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's why I walked in a lot down. I feel like a little boy. Like, yeah, I <laughs> look like a boy too. I at least I put some lashes on. Sometimes that's all you need, though. Lashes and lip gloss. Because I yep. definitely, that's, I got into my skincare. Yeah. So I know when I don't have the makeup on, you gonna put me perfect. a little lashes on, yeah. a little lip gloss, and I'm good to go. For sure. Yeah. For sure. I think sure. I'm tapping into that, though. I've been seeing a lot of girls like add the little pieces i don't know Underneath. if it's yeah uh, it's like clusters yeah mm -hmm. and then i'm like oh, okay so that's so easy and quick convenient you Keep know practicing yeah Practice. i think i want to do that okay i've seen it because like lashes it. like they fall off for mm -hmm. sure and i be and looking like a motherfucker i ain't gonna lie i be aggravated just touching shit i got like three <laughs> lashes on each eye right now but I, so i had to put strip on yeah <laughs> But man, I was like, dang, I'm like, okay, well, they cost a little, they cost, yeah, you for know, sure. and for they sure. fall off, well, I don't know if it's that last person that I was going to, mm -hmm. or if that's just how it is, but I know when Haley did mine, mm -hmm. <laughs> 
shade with it. No shade with it. No shade with it. No shade with it. It's not. It's not nothing personal. Y'all yeah, give me a break. <laughs> I'm telling you, that was my first, first, first time getting my lashes done, and they lasted a long time, and they were so good. pretty. That's how you know you got some good lashes. Natural, For like sure. you can sweat like, and yeah. everything, and they're still on. That's good. Yeah. You did your shit, girl. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> People no. ask me all the time if I'm doing lashes. Again. Yeah, Y'all. she fucked up telling me you did them because I'm put me in line. <laughs> I'll be asking her, but oh my gosh, yeah. <laughs> uh, I just got to a point. It was like pick one or the other. Which one you gonna do? Right, hair or lashes. Like, and I was doing it out my house, so it was just overpowering. Like the lash yeah. bed is in the living room. The mm-hmm. hair station is in the dining room. Now the only room we got left is the one bedroom. Me and my son. Shared. Yeah, yeah. That's just too much. Yeah. So I was like, you need to really put your passion into one thing all the way. And um, I chose hair. It was making me more money. We're glad you did. So I chose hair. And mm. I was like, and I've just been sticking to it ever since. I did yeah. order a lot of lash stuff. I was like, forget it. I'm going to just try again. I'm going to do it again. <laughs> and I still have all that stuff in a box in the garage. That's and I'm great. not even fooling with it. I, now I done picked up the podcast, so that's a wrap. Yeah. <laughs> this is my time. It's okay. We love a busy woman. We love yeah. a woman of many talents. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Especially a black woman. Black queen. <laughs> a black <Spicy>. woman. <laughs> you know. Love these black queens. Yes, for sure, for sure. And we I love, love the Caucasian ones, too. We yeah, love all of my Latina women. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to all the women. <laughs> At the end of the day, we still do love our black kings. For sure. For sure, for sure. <laughs> I'll drink to that. <laughs> so, speaking of black kings, is your son's dad a, b- a black king? <laughs> that was messy. Y'all said y'all weren't going to be messy. <laughs> <laughs> I told you we're going to love some stuff with that. That's fine. <laughs> My son's father is Nicaraguan. Okay. okay. So it's kind of close. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's, yeah. It's, so mm-hmm. it's an islander. You know, yeah. it's, by, it's by Jamaica. It's by the black people. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Are y'all still together? No. No. No, ma'am. Are you? No, ma'am. <laughs> we're, we're not together. <laughs> 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 not to get this so how is your dating life it's non-existent not i wish existing. it was you know what i'm saying i wish it was something to talk about but mm-mm. why is it you not ready or <laughs> are you your baby daddy likes to be the people you talk to like are you trying to work it out with him? You want to let your son grow up some up? Y'all want me to be honest. I want you to be really honest. I feel like when you're with somebody for so long, stepping outside that box, it makes me feel awkward. Like, if I did try to fuck with somebody else, I would probably either get too attached too quickly or I wouldn't give it enough energy. It's either one or the other. I'm either hot or cold. Mm-hmm. Like, I either got to be really, really feeling you or... It's really not even worth it. Like, I'm going home to my baby daddy. Fuck that. Right. <laughs> right. You know what I mean? Why do I waste my time? Like, you know what I'm saying? Some people do feel like that. That's yeah. crazy. That's but crazy. I mean, like, if y'all are interested in my baby daddy, y'all can have him. I mean, Girl, don't be giving up the whole cow on this just, podcast. Just know, like, when I'm ready to come home, I'm going to go home. <laughs> she's she still it's there. It's okay. It's okay. Sure. Y'all not together with y'all together. Y'all not together with y'all. No, you're not together, y'all. Y'all, y'all, com- y'all, just, y'all each other comfort. You, for sure, that's your that is for sure. That is for sure a safe space. Yeah, yeah. definitely a safe space. And a lot of like a lot of women, because you know, with me doing hair, I talk to people all day, all yeah. the time. Um, yeah, multiple women in a day. Yeah. Um, and a lot of people do feel that way. Um, going from being comfortable with somebody, yeah. giving them your all, them seeing you at your downs, your worst, you seeing them, mm-hmm. and then it's just like. We gotta throw it away and start over. Like, and start no, over. Start over. The dating pool sucks. The change. It's the like, change. It's, it dating Nobody is hard now. Change. When I start trying to date again, it was hard. It was mm-hmm. difficult. It didn't stick for a long time. I really? Was like, yeah, for a long time. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it just stuck. It yeah. something just stuck. So, but all before that, it was just like, is somebody really worth it? Exactly. And then exactly. I have a child too, a son at that, and I'm that not gonna. Let, takes a big impact. Yeah, for sure, sure. I'm not gonna just let anybody. If you not somebody that I feel like he can look up to exactly. or anything, then it's dead. Exactly. Sure. I'm wasting my energy. Yeah, you wasted my energy. You could look at their daddy like he posted. to. Exactly. <laughs> like, so, it's be like. I feel like people could end off on decent terms, though. Yeah, I feel for like sure. sometimes, for sure. um, some things just. 
they reach the end of the road. And yeah, it's yeah. like, you don't, everything not meant to be forever. forever. Yeah. And whenever you get acceptance with the fact that everything not meant to be forever yeah. and get comfortable with starting over in life, I feel like that's that's what changed me to be like, okay, be open to other stuff. Yeah. Be open to making friends, meeting new people, going on dates, yeah. like... Just be open to it, and you can date. Like, I think that's what I'm scared of. Actually, yeah, going I was just on the date, say, like you want a link, scary. Mm-hmm. no problem. Yeah. And then people that's have so all these I mean, freezing up. intentions. Yeah, it's like, I mean, freezing you want to take me to the movies? We ain't got to talk. We can just watch the movie. Yeah, <laughs> just vibes. We ain't like <laughs> yes, that's like, crazy. That's all want, so y'all know niggas. It's just like we know, <laughs> you know. Sometimes AB. stuff just it's just like. Sometimes stuff just hit their expiration date. Yeah. For sure. And, you yeah, know, when something sure. hit your, your, the expiration date in your house, what you do? You throw it away. Yeah, throw it it's sure. not like, oh, I hate that this milk didn't expire and I really want to keep it. And No, you just But you know how away. you got to go back to the store and re-up? <laughs> you, you know, like, you know <laughs> what I mean? Like, you you can get one go from the, the back next time. <laughs> one that's going to last longer. <laughs> yeah, one that's going to last longer. I like longer. this. So, I, like, I got to keep getting this, so... It just be hand in hand with yeah, this shit. No, for this sure. shit. Life is for crazy. Sure. Life is really crazy. crazy. And when they be telling you when you're in school, like when y'all think y'all got problems now, y'all don't know problems till y'all grow up. Oh, yeah. And I'm like, how you gonna tell me my problems not big? <laughs> but now it's like, girl, come on. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> come exactly. on. That was that, nothing. Yeah, exactly. That was nothing. That's crazy though. Life, life, life. What's a challenge you feel like you had to beat yourself up to overcome? Yeah. As of late, probably just hmm, setting time aside for myself. I used to pour into everybody else's cup and wasn't realizing my own cup was starting to get empty. Ooh, that's really what that y'all was. Y'all gave me chills. <laughs> they gave me chills. <laughs> but for they sure, I definitely relatable. had to. Dig yeah. deeper into myself, send time to take care of myself. You know Definitely what I'm saying? You can't be superwoman. I can't be yeah. everywhere in one place. That's you can't all. be for everybody and Ex- not for yourself. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Exactly. And if people feel like you're being stingy for that, they don't need to be around you. Yeah. Sometimes you need to be selfish, though. Sometimes you, you have to be, to be selfish and sometimes. I only want people around me that understand that. Exactly. Exactly. And if they can't, they need to grow up. They need to mm-hmm. grow up. Like, you got to grow up. <laughs> Something is wrong with you. Exactly. <laughs> I'm not exactly. the problem with you. Yeah. Because that point into everybody cup. Versus your own yeah. is so draining, it's and whenever you get to the to the breaking point, it's just like, what do I have of myself now? Yeah, mm-hmm. I feel where like, are you? Where am well, I? Like, like yeah. no, where is the person that you then per- poured they, into? Where where they exactly. busy? Exactly. They, they, they got they enough things they got going you on. Get on you get on, you start venting to them, and then they bounce back and start venting to you, and it's yeah. like <sighs> it's not working. Yeah, it's not working. So. I feel like nothing wrong with being selfish. I wouldn't think so. (laughs) I wonder why we put ourselves last. Well, a lot of, um, well, from us we talk. Yeah, for sure. Why? Why do we put ourselves on the back burner for people? Why do you feel like you put yourself on the back burner for people? I feel like maybe because of. How I know what it feels like to not have somebody in your corner. Mm-hmm. I try to be in everybody's corner for them. And then when I look back and see who am I, it don't really be nobody. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, as far as, like, the the really, just the the serious stuff. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got my mama and them. You know, they, but your mom yeah. can only do so much. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, as far as, like, how I'm feeling and stuff like that, you know. Stuff you want to talk about with a friend. Yeah, yeah. facts. Yeah. Facts. And facts. as I didn't got older, the people I really lean on the hardest are my yeah. sisters. Yeah. Because I feel like I didn't went through so many friends and friend groups. And yeah. Friend, well, yeah, friends and friend groups. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Which I do have two best friends that I don't see them ever leaving. If they try to leave, it's <laughs> welcome <laughs> to good, death row. Yeah. Well, that's <laughs> good. Welcome to this my that camera. Welcome to death row. <laughs> at Monty at Diamond. <laughs> that's yeah. my dogs. Um, but. My sisters is like, yeah. y'all can never go nowhere. I don't even have to say welcome to death row. Y'all Thanks. already stuck. Yeah. And so I try to lean more towards family now. Even yeah. even like with me going through having my son and stuff, right. I got really close with my family. And it was just like, okay, now I know I could call y'all. Yeah, for sure. Before, so it cool. didn't really feel like that. Same but now here. I know I could call Same y'all here. and 
y'all really can't go nowhere. Yeah. So see, that's gonna, cool. They can't close the door on you. They can't, always yeah. open. Yeah, it's you can't open. close the door on me. <laughs> brought y'all family in, brought their relationship, mm-hmm. and that's really nice. So how old were you when you first had six? I was twenty two. I turned 22. 22. I was 21, turned 22 okay. when I had him. Yep. Were you scared? Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. I, when I found out I was pregnant, I was like, girl, you ain't nobody mama. Like, <laughs> <laughs> how are you going to do this? Yeah. But at the time, like, me and my child's father were like, like this. Mm-hmm. So he really just made me feel like, you got this. Like, yeah. we yeah. got this together. This. You're going to be okay. I feel like you kind of documented your pregnancy on social media, too. Because I kind of remember, I feel like, don't quote me because <laughs> my memory then got bad. But I do think I remember you kind of popped out with a, like, oh, I'm pregnant. Mm-hmm. Was it, did you do the sign or what was it? How did you? Mm-mm, I was just like, you popped mm, out your stomach. I got a seat, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> but that was a tweet. It was, no, I, don't, I can't even remember the tweet. Okay. If we be honest, I cannot even remember the tweet. But I, I just, said something about the third trimester, and somebody was like, oh, I know you're not. I was like, girl, I am. And <laughs> you kind of just start posting pictures and stuff. Yeah, and I just, like, I just oh, went with like, it. Like, like, fuck you. Like, at first, I wanted to, I wanted to hide it, mm-hmm. but it was like, what am I going to hide it for? Like, this is a beautiful experience. I yeah. hate when people hide it. I understand you want to keep it to yourself, but that's a beautiful, it's a, be- a beautiful time. I'm not going to lie. That whole nine months is I Amazing. think my next one, I want to hide it. As you Why should. Next, as you Why? should. I just, I think I want to, I want to just kind of enjoy it to myself. Facts. Okay. You um, deserve I it. I want to document it, though. I do want to take pictures. Yeah. Not pregnant now, y'all. Not pregnant now. Speaking <laughs> for years and years later. <laughs> um, I just kind of want to enjoy it myself. Like, yeah. I want to do stuff and... You know, just... Have something for yourself. I just want to have it for myself. Now, I'm not saying keep it a secret the whole time, but I just want to tell you, I feel like last time I didn't really get a chance to digest it, like, before everybody knew. It was like, everybody finding out, and I just found out. And so it was kind of... Mm-hmm. It shakes you up a little bit when everybody yeah. know. Like mm-hmm. it's just, I don't know. It's a big change. It's a different now it's just like everywhere you go, hey pregnant. Girl. Hey, like <laughs> out of your like, business. I'm Haley. <laughs> <laughs> Call me Haley. Not hey pregnant. <laughs> hey big girl. I'm not even showing yet. <laughs> you are really small. So when did you start showing? Seven months. Dang. Eight months, maybe. Like, I was still able to put jeans on. And oh. I just wore, like, T-shirts all yeah. the time. Yeah. Um, so, I didn't That's show for crazy. a long time. And then, after I had him, it, all the weight went away. Yeah. I didn't get nothing, but Blessed. I got some breasts a little bit. And yeah. they went away. <laughs> oh Once I froze perfect. my milk. Oh, my goodness. Dang. How does it feel to be God's favorite? <laughs> I mean, some people say God's favorite, but I'd be like, he could have left me with some butt, <laughs> some legs. Nah, some. You don't got a little... I got a little rock, but... Yeah, you got a little... So 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 like don't discredit yourself. It, it was like a dump truck, like I was expecting. <laughs> <laughs> expecting a thing to be hanging. Oh, so you want a big booty with... Shelf booty. Not, 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 not no booty. big legs and stuff. You want, you want <laughs> Subba Walker? No, I don't not want so that. If I wanted that, I would have went bought that. I'm trying to. I'm trying to eat. You know, I'm yeah. just. I'm a naturally just get that. The only yeah. thing I did think sure. about though is buying some breasts. Right. I thought about it. Go ahead. Cause why not? A little treat, <laughs> a little treat yourself. Just a little cheeky. Just like a little cheeky. I don't want nothing huge. Yeah. Like a rack. Like a little B cup or yeah. something. Okay. Something slight. Like, yeah. Just because. That's yeah. cute. Just because. Okay. <laughs> hey. Your body, your choice. Yeah. Facts. Y'all thought about getting surgery before? On oh, anything. Um, if I could do anything, probably I think I want some titties too. These are a little small. I want to be. I want to be proportionate. Yeah. I want like a little little C cup to match his to match his ass. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I feel yeah. like I would get a lift. Mm-hmm. My boobs lifted because y'all like I used to have perky, perky, perky titties. Me too. And it's Me like too. I grew like I grew up, y'all. It's so crazy. Yeah. yeah. I was like, oh. But I feel like um I have hip dips. Do y'all have hip dips? I, I have some with no hips. hips. Like I get the dips with no hips. <laughs> now see I have hips. But it's like mm, it happens a little days like 
okay, now now you playing with me. Now like if I if I pose like a certain way, yeah, it's, it's like it's yeah. all in the angles. Yeah, yeah, yeah like let me talk about the square angles. on one side. You know, oh like, my god, like, what is what is going on? So it's like you know it have its pros and cons, but mm-hmm. I feel like I already have like a nice shape, like as far as like an hourglass. You have a really pretty body, but. My back rows, like I will, I will get all that, like just yeah tone. But I think I could work that out if I stop being lazy. Yeah, yeah, for sure. <laughs> for sure. I could work that out. For sure, for sure. And it be I like think- nowadays, like I know a lot of people be like, "Why well, work out when you could just buy it?" Yeah. But then it be like, "Man, I'm homegrown. This homegrown." Thanks. Attention, all business owners and aspiring business owners. What if I told you you can invest into your personal credit report to be able to get approved for 50k minimum on the personal side of the 250k on the business side to grow your business or even start a business or invest in assets you feel me now imagine that getting approved for money and you ain't come out of pocket not one dime that's what we here for at key to royalty me and my team we'll get you right we'll get you the blueprint to have you on the path of righteousness quick if you're interested be in me credit on Facebook or Instagram, and I'll make it my business to get back to you. While you at it, check out these results from my past clients. So, <laughs> since we back from our break, yes, ma'am. let's get into it. Let's get into this I'm tree. Let's toast to it before we start. Toast to six is sweet too. <laughs> I'm ready to see y'all's reactions. <laughs> Deliciousness. Cast, y'all want to come grab y'all's? Oh, they melting. It's okay. Eat them fast, y'all. Eat them fast. Mm-hmm. Now look. Look at Aiko. You don't even know. <laughs> How would they know? But yeah, let me get the... Get a little reaction cuss. video. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't first want to record. <laughs> Bro, no, you're so funny. <laughs> Cause you really started to eat that hoe at first. You I was really that was ready to eat it, but I'm like, let me wait before I just bite and see if they want to bite on t- on cue or something. I've already licked the top. <laughs> Okay. Y'all want one? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's I definitely made sure I had enough for everybody. <laughs> I'm scared. You scared, girl? <laughs> Be confident. Know that it's good. I heard that it's real good, so. Yeah, this is who I want to be for the video. Hmm? This is who I want to be. <laughs> it matches. It matches. <laughs> it matches the thing. Okay. okay. Getting ready to test. Look, let me show y'all a little bit. <laughs> One. I thought we were here. It's okay. Mm. <laughs> I should have got you some spoons. Oh my no, it's mm. okay, girl. Mm. We've been up. Sit down. <laughs> hmm. Do you like it for real? Oh. No, I'm for real. It's good. Fire. <laughs> See, I'm done. <laughs> the cast is back there. Yeah, I already know. <laughs> Y'all want to see them? <laughs> licking the... They back there oh, licking me. the fabric. The <laughs> cupcake holder the fabric. On me, y'all. <laughs> mm, I'm so glad Uzi I like approved. <laughs> this gets it. <laughs> save it. Yeah, let me save this. <laughs> oh, yeah. He gonna be like... Bring that girl from the talk show. Right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, me. So, what is on here? What's at the top? So, it's strawberry jello, vanilla pudding, um, mixed around, mm-hmm. just with some butter, and then uh, golden Oreo. Mm. So, it's a little bit of Oreo cream in there, too, and all that. Girl, I'm trying not to go crazy. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Like, <laughs> like, you want some more? <laughs> He's looking at his fingers and some else. <laughs> like, I really want to finish it. Can I finish it off camera? <laughs> Y'all, please. <laughs> oh, 
I'm glad. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> no, for real. I, I'm really trying not to be messy. Like, yeah. but I'm really down it right now. Like, yeah. as you should. That'll, it's good. It's for you to indulge in and to enjoy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm fucking with this. What happened, Haley? I bit the rapper. Oh. Oh, yeah. I thought he was cutting it out. I hope you put the point when you was licking the rapper. (laughs) (laughs) Man. At least I know it's good, though. That's just confirmation that it's good. 10 out of 10. Thank you. Ten ten out of ten. Ten. Thank really you. good. Really sweet. I like it. It wasn't too, you know, some be like, it be overbearing. Like, I don't know what exactly, yeah. what the flavor is. Is it a cheesecake flavor? Mm-hmm. But it'll just be overbearing. I like it, though. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, you a cheesecake girl? I like cheesecake. I prefer, so. I really like strawberry cheesecake. Like, whenever it's the strawberry and it's filled with cheesecake. Yeah. I love that. <laughs> the girl we was talking to earlier, Kaylee, she used to make some, and I used to get like three dozen. Damn. And eat them before the strawberries go bad. <laughs> <laughs> now, see, like strawberries, I really don't care for strawberries, like just as a fruit, period. Yeah. But, like, you know, stuff like this, mm-hmm. I'll get. But I'm strawberries, so I like them. Yeah. It's good. Mm-hmm. Well worth the wait, because I've been waiting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so next time you do those pies, those cheesecake cups too, because I've seen yeah. them. I've seen you too. <laughs> I feel like, like y'all oh. fuck with them a lot better too. And it's a lot more in the cup. Like, mm-hmm. It's a lot more cheesecake in the cup. Mm-hmm. It's uh the crust, mm-hmm. cheesecake, real strawberries, um, the topping in between, more cheesecake, more strawberries. Just repeat it. Yeah. I can't wait for y'all to try them. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm waiting on the next drop. I'm waiting. <laughs> so, do you um, do you just have a a want for sweets? Like, you just want sweets? Or, I used to say you smoke. Or do you smoke to eat sweets? Um, it's really a little bit of both. It probably get worse when I'm high. I get the munchies and I just be like, ooh, them cupcakes still in there? <laughs> but I always got a sweet tooth. I be craving it. Yeah. I'm dabbing it every day. And I feel like I don't really have a sweet tooth. Like, I got to want it yeah. to buy it. Because yeah. sometimes I'll buy sweets from people and yeah. be like, I know I'm going to want this one day. And I'll put it in the icebox and it'll be like eight days later. And I'm like, damn. I think this is just so extra. You got to be craving you this specific thing. Yeah. That's mm-hmm. why at a point I was just seasonal. So, mm-hmm. you know, that's why it is. Sweet potato pie don't go out of season. Yeah. I don't care what y'all nobody so? say. Mm-mm. I love I sweet love potato y'all pie. Y'all the first people to tell me that. Yeah. If y'all yeah. want it all year round, I mean, I'll get it going. But girl, I, I didn't think that people would want it. I love sweet potato pie. pie. That's, I did not think I that people would like, want it. I could eat like a whole pie by myself. <laughs> like, I don't play with I don't play with Ooh. this. Ooh. <laughs> I don't play with this for sure. They looking out for y'all, because I wasn't trying to make that out of you, but I know yeah. I'll do it. <laughs> make that. Them people going to want that. <laughs> for real. So, with you smoking, you feel like... <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> do you feel like it's an addiction at this point, or do you nah. feel more so like it's just recreational? I just do this because... Definitely recreational, because if I'm not going out, or if I'm not, like, just on some, like... Kicking it with my friends type shit. I ain't gonna roll up. Yeah. Like, you know, it's just like, if I got it, okay, cool. We about to smoke a bit. Okay. Or I'll match somebody. You know, you know how that go. Because <laughs> we seen the tweet where you was like, how you got violently high. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> hey, we were just curious. Let me get high. Violently high. Yeah, I get high. So, what you talking, like, you talking, that like, you got a anything. bong? Yeah, that could we be was like, like we gonna see. Like shrooms. Did you get that on could a- be, like, some, some za, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. That's just, mm-hmm. nothing like, too crazy, just, though, y'all. Yeah, like, yeah, nothing too crazy. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 don't take it that way. Don't take it that way. Wait a damn minute. No, no, don't 
don't take it that way. Don't take it that no, way. No, we was just like, yeah. okay, she could smoke. Like, okay, somebody didn't smoke. Because um, so far, the people that we bought, nobody smoked. Well, one person That's did good. smoke, but he was like a undercover smoke. Like, don't tell everybody I smoke. I'm like, yeah. okay. And she I used to smoke. I, I, I stopped. Right <laughs> <laughs> Y'all gonna shout hop, hop, this <laughs> yeah. I stopped. Right. I, I recently stopped, too. And it was like, I felt the same way as you. Um, but then it got to the point, like, okay, well, let me start my day. I'm gonna smoke, eat, mm-hmm. get myself together. Like, we talked about um, time to yourself. I'm getting to that, too. But yeah. um, it just felt like, I, I don't know. I'm like... It's not even really just uh, what I want to do. <laughs> Y'all can hate on it. Y'all ain't getting high enough. Y'all talk <laughs> shit about me. Guys. No, for real. No, some, some. Oh. Here, rep the brand, goddammit. Smoke some, bitch. You know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> some thaw shit. You know, smoke some. I feel better. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, I could do that on camera? Yeah. If you want to, yes. This is an open platform. Yeah. Almost too cool, huh? Hold <laughs> on, what did it say? Too damn thought to go outside. Huh? <laughs> come on what you now. About? What you talking about? Girl, come on, this? man. We just told you smoke yeah. some. Oh, she showed me this earlier. <laughs> what is this powder called again? It's Keith. Keith. Oh, shit. Y'all ain't gonna get me high. <laughs> is oh, this considered a free roll? <laughs> yeah, like it a is. backwoods to me. This, <laughs> this whole is stuff too. I'm scared. Somebody sparked. I don't want to spark it. <laughs> it got wax in this bitch. <laughs> Y'all. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't want to spark. I'm scared. What you scared of? Come on, what this shit? Just say. Uh, what is my eye go lazy? Cause I'm just so hot. Like, yeah. <laughs> just take your time. Take your time. Take your time. Yeah. But yeah, I'm not a um. I wouldn't consider myself a smoker. I don't smoke at all. Um. I definitely could pass a P test. Yeah. So. Feel good saying, uh, you want to pee for you? Yeah. <laughs> I can pee for you. I can pee for you. I can pee for you. <laughs> You said it, all right. I'm going to be texting, hey, friend. Let me know, I got the goods. I know you said you was clean. I got the goods. (laughs) Is it just, is it a comfort thing, though? Mm. For sure. Comfort. For sure, I'll be kicking it. Vibe down. It keep me mellow. Yeah. Yeah. That was the whole purpose for me. Just at ease. Like, just make me feel like I was just so turned up. And I feel so chill. Like yeah, no, when I chill. when it yeah. used to be back in my little day, I I was really I would just feel I don't know. I just didn't have no like my mind just felt like it wasn't working. Mm-hmm. Constantly moving. Yeah. It would be like a sleep time thing. Like, okay, do this yeah. at night. You just gotta keep yourself stimulated. Mm-hmm. Don't let it be the start of your day and the end of your day at the same time. You know right. what I'm saying? Smoke your J. You know, it ain't got to be no big ass thing like that. You know, little, little paper. You know, yes, something. back then something like that could last me like a week. Get your next <laughs> No, for real. I really took like a couple months away from smoking, That's and good. then when I started working out, like it gave me the energy to just you know what I'm saying to okay. go. Yeah, you know, like why not? Yeah. yeah, I feel like as long as it's not taking over your life, it's no problem. Facts. It's Facts. no when when you have when you're a non functional. Weed smoker. Yeah, you're not that means you need to done. stop. Yeah. You need to stop. Stop doing drugs if you can't do shit on them. Yeah. <laughs> that, no, literally. The weed, the, the drug no smoking. You drugs if you can't do nothing Dare to be on different. Them. Don't Dare be like me. Because <laughs> you signed that package saying you wasn't going to do drugs. You participated in Red Ribbon Weed. <laughs> Seven years old, like, weed? Why would I ever? Don't look at me. That's just <laughs> But I, I just really don't feel like weed is like just so bad. It's yeah, not. It's not it's not bad. I don't feel like it's bad. I really don't feel like it's bad. I don't I don't want my siblings to ever try it though. But <laughs> yeah, you know, I, I don't it's not bad. 
it's it's not it's not bad. I just don't <laughs> want them to grow up. I don't want them to even want to do stuff like this. Especially at a certain <laughs> age when kids be trying it, it be, it consumes them, yeah. and that's all they worried about at the time. Yeah. Okay, mm-hmm. now I gotta go get some weed. Me and my right. brother gotta go smoke. Yeah. No, sixteen. You man. exactly. You still young. You can still go kick it and chill sober. Yeah, y'all ain't even gotta take a shot of nothing. Exactly. Exactly. You used to be so lit sober. <laughs> man. Like, that's I the just, best fun. Yeah, yeah. I if feel you, like I feel like you. I, you need to be mature enough for that because Facts. I think my first time trying to smoke yeah. was 10th grade and I hated it. I couldn't even stand it. Like, I was coughing. I was about yeah. to throw up. Like, <laughs> it was crazy. Yeah. Yes, yeah. it was crazy. I'm like, yeah. It's, I don't know. It's why. harsh. It's so harsh hard. on your body mm-hmm. when you're I don't younger. know why y'all smoke. That shit don't need to give you. Like, I don't know. But, man, once I actually learned how yeah. to hit it, yeah. you know, I'm like, okay. I, I kind of understand, but, you know. Yeah, that's what a lot of stuff though. Like <laughs> people be trying to grow up fast. They don't yeah. know like For you sure. getting on a, an addiction that could bring you either right or left. That's yeah. just like exactly. with sex. Like exactly. sex could be an addiction, and it can make yeah. you either go right or left. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Some people can, and some people can't handle it. Yeah. Exactly. Don't let that stuff. I don't know. That's all the devil. <laughs> it's just the devil. It's the devil. It's the devil. It's the devil. It's the demon. <laughs> Leave that shit alone. <laughs> no, but for real. For real, for real, for real. But like I uh I was finna say earlier, um, I started doing this thing now as far as we talk about time. You need yeah. time for yourself. Yeah. To where now versus starting work at nine AM, eight thirty AM, yeah. I don't start till ten. And I'm really thinking about starting eleven. I only start at 10 because I want to get more people in. Uh-huh. But I'm starting to lean towards doing 11. That's good. Get your breakfast in, meditate. My, your, you and know I'm what I'm saying? Yes, breakfast. Sit down, catch up on work, catch up on right. DMs, pray. If I'm reading a book at a time, right. I'm going to read and catch up on the book. Even if I just want to sleep in. Like, exactly. I want to do that. And so I was on a Zoom call with a lady one day. Mm-hmm. She's a millionaire. I forgot uh no I didn't forget. Her name is Mystique Creations, and she was she have like four kids. Well, she have three kids, and she mm-hmm. can have a fourth kid. Mm-hmm. And she was just saying like, as a millionaire, like I'm still a person, and I have to take my time out. She like have a mm-hmm. col- color coded calendar. Now I got my color coded calendar, yeah. and she like from X time to X time. You need to sit there for yourself. Like, not right. only women, but men, too. Because right. your work and your life and your business and everything could just overpower. Right. We're not and robots. We yeah. To, cloud what you yeah. have in your mind. Yeah. And so I definitely take heed to that before 10 o'clock. Like, I don't want to really That's talk so to good. nobody before yeah. 10. That's good. Get your headspace correct for your day start. Yes. <laughs> so, Bree. It was nice <laughs> having you. It was fun. I, I could definitely do this again. Y'all would definitely make me very comfortable. And oh, y'all are hilarious. Wow. I like <laughs> to y'all hear y'all are great. I'm so glad that y'all had me. I like to hear that. Like, everybody <laughs> who didn't came on here so far, and yeah. they be nervous at first, they all talk about coming back. Yeah. Like, let's do it again. This today. is something that you should definitely, like, keep going, for yeah. sure. Like, I love what y'all are doing. And I feel like the whole team... Is inspiring. I was just telling my homegirl the other day. I said, bro, they got a whole thing going on to where each person is doing their own thing. And they yeah. make it just come together. She was like, damn, I didn't know how to do all that. I'm yeah. like, that's what I'm trying to see. Like, <laughs> Shout like, out to like, the boss man. Really, it, it's really cool that y'all can have that type of relationship with yeah. each other. To where y'all feeding and benefiting all, all together. All yeah. around. Just... Thank making you. things better for Thank everybody you. too. We I'm so glad we got course, to do yeah. this. We really of got course. to get to know you some more. Yeah. Our research we did, it, it gave us a little dive, but we scratched the surface. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> nothing. Nothing. <laughs> yeah. Literally. We thought she was from orange. Yeah. Literally. Yeah, that threw me off. So we got, we got the wrong memo <laughs> it's on right. that part. It's right. It's right. But like ain't nothing that. Yeah, we like it. Yeah. <laughs> Well, thank you sure. again. Thank you. I'm glad y'all like the treats. Y'all yes, can, can we love. People. Oh, that's for us. Yeah, um, that's for us. Yeah, when we throw out the <laughs> pop up shop, we would love to have you come. Yeah, with your treats. absolutely. So, whenever they get into the works, we go send it off. To of you. course, it'll be the cups next time. Just for you. Oh whatever no, it'll be. It's whatever you want. Yeah. Like 
you'll be able to just Break set up shop and sell your stuff. Yeah, sell okay, your stuff. Cool. Do yeah. your stuff, you know. That's a bit. Thank y'all yeah. for having me again. No problem. <laughs> Thank you for coming. For sure. And thank y'all for, sure. for tuning in. We hope to see y'all next week. Friday is 7 p.m. <laughs> Bye, y'all. <laughs> Bye.